Cancer is a growing health problem affecting different people depending on the risk factors. But what is this monster called cancer? Cancer is a condition that occurs when particular parts of the body uh, grow at a faster rate than the rest of the cells. When at a particular spot in the body, uh, the cells, which are the smallest building blocks of our body, start growing abnormally, and usually they grow faster than the rest of the cells. That's why it most often presents as a swelling, and uh, it can occur in any part or in any part of the body. It can be in the blood, it can be on the skin, it can be in the lungs, it can be in the liver, stomach, any part of the body can have its cells turn cancerous. There is no clear cause uh, that we can blame and the one responsible for causing cancer. But there are many predisposing factors which we usually suspect depending on which type of cancer we are talking about. There are over 100 different types of cancer, but let us take a look at colon cancer that affects both males and females. Colon cancer affects the digestive tract's lower end of the large intestine, but can be treated when detected early. We have uh, four stages of cancer generally, uh, as well as for colon cancer. The stage one and two, those are considered early. The doctors can resect the cancer and remove it and join back the colon so that the system can work normally. Sometimes the colon cancer is in a very tricky place and the doctors are not able to do that. But stage three and four are quite late. Uh, that's when the cancer is going to the lymph nodes, it's going to other organs. In that case, cure is a challenge. Dr. Fred Okoko at Uganda Cancer Institute explains some of the early signs of colon cancer. Most people will see bleeding blood, uh, blood through stool. Um, that is one of the commonest signs. But the other one is the early signs include uh, constipation, you know, having difficulty passing stool. Um, you have uh, bloating, you, keep, you feel full most of the time, even when you eat a little. Um, the other signs include appetite coming low, uh, losing weight. To control colon cancer, doctors advise people to limit the intake of highly refined foods, eat fiber-rich diet, to ease the movement of stool. In three, four days, five days, you're not passing stool is not healthy. You'll be doing your colon more, uh, exposing it to more toxins. So regular emptying of the colon is a good thing. Uh, most people once a day, other people twice a day. But it's good. When you empty, you clean out. All the dirt comes out. And in that way, you keep a healthy colon. In general, almost all cancers can be managed if detected early. The reason doctors advise people to embrace routine cancer screening. 